The most important means of modern transport is the aeroplane, providing speedy transit to and from all corners of the globe. A fascinating blend of East and West. The British Crown Colony of Hong Kong, once a fishing village, has a lot to offer visitors. The tourist really has to experience the many sights. Shopping in the myriad of small stores and strolling through the narrow streets is something not to be missed. Kai-Tak Airport is one of the busiest in air traffic. Hundreds of aircraft take off and land every day on the single runway stretching out into the harbour. The planes approach over the houses of Kowloon, the most densely populated area in the world. Up to 200,000 people per square kilometre live or work here in one of the many apartment blocks and skyscrapers. Every pilot dreads the complicated approach path skimming the roofs of the town. There's long been a need for a new airport, one meeting the requirements of modern air traffic. Space has always been the name of the game in the overcrowded Crown Colony. But now, an ambitious and unique project is underway. 1,200 hectares are required for Hong Kong's new airport. The Virgin Island of Cheplak Kok Three kilometers long, one kilometer wide, with elevations of 120 meters, is being flattened by a veritable army of machines. The rocks removed are tipped into the three to five meter deep surrounding sea to provide the platform for the new airport. The RH-200 is in its element. The 22 cubic meter shovel, adapted for the purpose, digs vigorously into the blasted material, ensuring fast cycles. The RH-200 is the most frequently used excavator of its class in the world. Tri-power, the patented geometry with automatic double parallel shovel guidance, maximizes bucket fill. Optimum power conversion by the electronic pump managing system, PMS, ensures maximum loading performance.
Now, in real time, watch the RH200 at work. Two loads to go. And the 136 metric tonner is on its way. As a matter of interest, let's time the productivity of what's going on in the foreground as well as in the background. The next truck moves into position in less than 30 seconds. Now, the truck is fully laden. And on the move. The dense traffic on the site hall roads testifies to the enormous volumes of rock which are being moved to reclaim the vast area needed for Hong Kong's new airport. Between the start in February and September 1993, more than 200 hectares of new land were already reclaimed from the sea. RH200, king of performance, doing the job for the new gateway of the future.